All right. So it's written in function notation. It's a composite of two functions, which basically means it's a double substitution. The first input becomes an output. That output becomes a secondary input. It's like a domino. Okay. So this f o g fog of 12 is the same thing as f of g of 12. Okay. If you want to do it in two parts, right, so this is one option. You can first take g of 12. So if the function is radical x minus 8, it's 12 minus 8, and so that's 4, and the square root of 4 is 2. So g of 12 gives the output 2. Yeah? Okay. So if I want f of g of 12, that g of 12 is equal to 2. So really, I'm asking you, give me f of 2. So now I'm going to throw in the 2 minus 4x2 plus 2, so I get negative 6. And so that is f of g of 12. Whoops. Okay. That was in two steps. But for those of you afterwards are like, hey, let's uh, get this done quickly. How do I get it done quickly? Some of you realize if you write the first function, here, let me write up here because I'm running out of space. Oh, wait. Okay, so if this is your... Your outer function, your secondary function, is the f of x function. Your substitution is the g function, and the x is the 12. If you wanted to do it in one shot and put it all in your calculator in one shot, you can, but you have to know how to substitute it. So the f of x function is your initial skeleton, minus 4x plus 2, right? The f function is minus 4x plus 2. But instead of x, I'm substituting the g function. And then instead of x, I'm plugging in 12. So in this substitution of x is the square root of x minus 8. But instead of the x, I'm plugging in a 12. So if you were to throw that into a calculator, let's find light. All right, it's like dead center. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, so negative 4 parentheses, square root 12 minus 8 out. Oh, wait, whoops, don't do that. Click out, then parentheses, plus 2. And so there's my minus 6. I thought I got the wrong answer. And there's your negative 6. So... You could do it in one shot, or you can do it in two parts. It's just preference. So we did this October of last semester. You guys had your test. But this is function notation. These are composites. Um, if, so these are the numbers. OK, so then when you get down to 17, where it's f of g of x, if they want f of g of x, and f of x is negative 9x plus 3, and g of x is x to the 4th, but notice, what do I want substituted for x? I want it left alone. I want it to stay as x. I don't want a number to be substituted. Leave it in x notation, okay? So the initial f function is negative 9x plus 3. And you're going to substitute the g function everywhere you see an x in the f function. That's substitution. And so g of x is x to the fourth, and so an x to the fourth gets placed in that empty space, right? Okay, and so what do you get? Negative 9 x to the fourth plus 3, and that's your f of g of x. Okay, 
The entire assignment, you're not obligated to do the entire assignment. Let me just turn it off. 